There's a lot of Funko sales going on and I want to talk about it. <laughs> There's a lot of Funko sales going on, Heather. Not only are there sales online, but there's also sales in store at Funko Hollywood. Wow. They're doing mystery bags, and we're gonna talk about all of that. We're also gonna look at the sale items on Funko.com right now. There's a ton of sale items, a lot of Funko Pop sodas, and all sorts of other things, like Super Markdown. Some stuff has like sold out already because I guess people decided to take them up on the sale offer. Or were the, they the type of sales where it's like, hey, we're having a sale and it's like already sold out, but for some reason it's still on the website? Sort of. Okay, because yeah. that sometimes happens with other websites I've noticed. What, that the item sold out so it's, it's still up? It's sold out so it still appears up and it's part of the sale even though it's sold out. Oh, I see. Well, it's there's... like a weird part of the website. I don't know. Yeah, well, okay. So, then, by the way, this is going to be an unedited video because, uh, look, we, we, we're hard at work doing Mischief Toys things. We don't have time to do a lot of editing around here right now. So we're putting out unedited footage. So if Heather farts, sneezes, you hear a dog outside, if I just happen to fall out of my chair, it's all staying in. What do you think of that? I hope you fall out of your chair. I like how there's a dog on kill. He's out there yeah. barking his little butt off. Yeah, he's like, he's like, oh, you mentioned a dog, here I am. <laughs> all right, so look. 70% off exclusive up for fan to. up to for fan rewards members only. By the way, who isn't a fan's reward member by now? Isn't that like, don't you have to be a fan? You don't uh, have to. I thought in order to buy stuff, you had to like sign in. You don't, you don't have to. You can oh, you check out to. as a guest or oh, whatever. Interesting. Yeah, okay. you don't have to. I mean, it's silly if you're not a fan. Or, f or fan rewards. Yeah. Because you, you, you like earn do. points and yeah. stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it's important. It's very important. Yeah. So it basically says on 15th of April uh, at 11.59 p.m. Pacific time uh, on, let's see, on April 17th, 2024. Okay, so I guess it's from the 15th to the 17th. To qualify for promotion, fan reward members must be logged into their fan rewards account to receive the discounted pricing. So I'm wondering what they're going to have to offer on here. I, here's what I'm thinking is going on right now. Mm -hmm. I think Funko is doing everything that they can to get rid of a bunch of old inventory mm -hmm. because they want to bring in new stuff or maybe this whole, you know, what, what do they call it? Like their slim down company model, lean like lean startup. startup. Like maybe they want to do that whole lean startup thing and they want to bring in new product in, in which they can start that process. Why is that one diet thing? Slim fast. That's what you reminded me of. When you said slim down? Oh. <laughs> slim fast? <laughs> oh my god, I haven't heard slim fast in a very long hey, time. Hey, listen, you are now. Funko, <laughs> Funko's on that slim fast diet. And then, look, so this isn't the only one. Okay. Look at this one. Golly gee, what could it be? $20 mystery bags over at Funko Hollywood. This will actually take place between April 15th and 16th. Wow. Yeah, so this is um, pretty cool. Like, I'd be interested in this if I lived nearby. But this is yet another way for them to get rid of their garbage, I feel like. Likely, however. Oh my God, how'd that happen? However, I did just see a post, and I don't know how real it is, but someone said that they got their Funko sodas from the $5 soda mystery thing. Yes. They're really good sodas. Really? Very. Like yeah. what? Um, so in this photo, ah, I don't know where it went. I don't know where it went, but they okay, were well, like... give us an idea of what it they was. They were LE pieces. Like, I rem I saw a 3000 LE What? Something. For real? Yes. Wow, that's pretty good. Yeah, So those really sodas good. weren't that bad. But see, that's what I, why I feel like they're discontinuing sodas. I feel like sodas are going away. At least, like, n going away in the way that they were before, maybe more limited now, or, like, in smaller amounts. Because before, they were making just amount... Just about the same of, of the sodas as they were Funko Pops. Gotcha. So now you're yeah. gonna try to find the photo? I'm gonna try, I don't think I'm gonna be, oh, here it is. Oh. So there's a Crash Bandicoot at 12,500, He-Man at 10,000, the Terra Away Face Clown at 3,000, uh, Scarlet Witch 2,500, Huckleberry Hound 5,000, and wow. Oogie Boogie, well, that's 20K. But yeah, I mean that, for five bucks. That's not bad. However, um, well, actually, they said it's fake. 
So. Oh, it's fake? Hey, listen. <laughs> you. <laughs> good, good God, Heather. Couldn't you bring us real information? I, All right, so we got a, that's a I fake photo. Scro I Great. scrolled. Fake news. So I, I thought it was a joke, but I wasn't sure. Okay. And reading the comments, they said that it's fake. Well, golly gee, Heather showing us fake stuff f for free. Um, but look, uh, $20 mystery bags over at Funko Hollywood. So if you live nearby, maybe you go and check it out. It says while supplies last. So I have no idea how many of these are going to make. They're not mentioning it here at all. Includes three Funko Pops. So it could pr practically $20. be anything. I'm really hoping that they sprinkle in some really good stuff. That's my hope for the people who actually go there. Like it would be nice if they had that. Do you think they will? I don't know. I don't know. With Funko nowadays, it's really hard to say. I don't know what they're doing. Yeah, like right. they're always throwing curveballs. Like the the Project Fred thing was a complete curveball. I did not expect to see that at all. No. No, that was weird. That was so poopy. There are these two things. By the way, this is tomorrow. I feel like I feel like I read somewhere that this is an extension. I feel like I think disc trackers actually said this was an extension. Like it's an extended sale from the original sale. Let me say. No. Okay. Never mind. This, this must have been something else. Um, but I, I'm looking forward to seeing what the deal items are for this. And we might have a continuation video tomorrow to talk about what those items are. Because 70% off, up to 70% off, that's really great. You can get Fungo Pops possibly for like, what, two bucks, three bucks? Maybe. I don't know. I feel like there's not very many items that are going to be 70%. Like, I think most would be 30 to 40%, not 70. I'm looking forward to seeing what they have to offer, though. Me too. Because it could be a pretty cool lineup. We could sit here and talk crap and say, oh, they're getting rid of their trash. I mean, I think that's part of it. Like, not necessarily trash, but just get rid of inventory. Trash. Okay. But it'll be cool to see what's up there because it might be a couple pieces that we want. You know what I mean? Yeah, well, I remember I would buy Funko shirts as they would go up. Yeah. And they would often end up on clearance. So they might have so some So it could be really, a shirt? They might have some really cool shirts. Yeah, because it doesn't say anything specific about this, right? It doesn't yeah. say, like, it's a Funko Papa soda or anything. It's, it's not very specific, so it could be clothes. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's normally, like, everything. That'd be cool. So here's the other sale thing. Obviously, this is if you buy $50 or more on Fungo.com, you get a very special Farmer Freddy. And as we had mentioned in the past, I feel like this Farmer Freddy is a really great Funko Pop. And this was a perfect Funko Pop to throw in and say, hey, if you spend a certain amount of money, you'll get this thing. Yeah. Because this is, this, this is to me, worth it to go spend that kind of money to get it because I love this Funko Pop He's so much. He's cute. Yeah, I really like this, this Pop. I find it very interesting that they're saying that this free item is final sale. Yeah, yeah. That's weird. Well, everything over there is final sale, isn't it? Yeah, but like, why why do they have to say, is it like we don't want this back so you're forced to keep it? <laughs> yeah, I think that's what they Yeah, do not send this back to us. Yeah, we don't want it. It's weird. We don't want any of our stuff back. Please do not send it back. It's really weird. You know what? I... This is going to sound really mean, but remember last year when the whole Fun Days thing happened and people were sending back their Funko Pops because Funko was like, oh, you know, we'll make this right for you. What if instead of sending those back, they just got a bunch of these Farmer Freddy's back? <laughs> and it's like they, they screw up again this year, piss a bunch of people off, and they're like, you know what? Screw Funko. Have your Farmer Freddy back. Enjoy your Farmer Freddy. That you said we can't return. Ha! You ha. got him. I like this one, though. He's adorable. It has an Earth Day box on it. Yeah, I really like him because I like plants. I planted some raspberries. And he's got the grandma hat on. Yeah. That's a grandma hat, right? I mean, come on, let's be it real. It is. It looks just like the one that I wear daily. Like, you could take the head off of that Funko Pop and put an old woman on it, and mm -hmm. it fits perfectly. Yeah. Right? Or, yeah. or you. Yeah, or me. Did you hear what I said? That's you. That's your outfit. No, did I? Did you hear what I said? No. I planted my raspberries yesterday. You did? Yeah. Huh? I planted them. I'm I gonna can't get wait. Some raspberries. I can't wait not to eat those. You know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm gonna do? What? Look that way. No. Look that way, please. I'm not doing that. Look that way, please. You know, I was wincing the entire time because I thought you were gonna like, like lick my ear or do something. No. Weird. Oh, okay, you almost did. I just I wanted to make really weird noises. Look, there's a couple other photos I captured just because I want to talk about it. Then we'll go into the sale items, but there's this. 
Captain still. Proto. First Officer Proto. Yeah, the one That's that everyone's cool. mad at because he stole Freddy Funko's spot. Yeah. <laughs> right. I mean, to be fair, though, if someone said, hey, Heather, your flight has a dog pilot, I'd be like, <laughs> okay, that's cool. Let's do it. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. If it had a dog pilot, you'd be all in? He that's knows insane. what he's doing. Look at him. He has his tongue out. Yeah. <laughs> what that doesn't so say. So did I. That, that does not say that we're going to have a good flight. He's getting ready for the raspberries. <laughs> I'm very concerned about him with his tongue out. And then there's this he, picture. He's about to eat Pilot Freddy's ass. <laughs> <laughs> then there's this photo of a bunch of Funko Pops from C2E2 being flipped already. Okay. They're not even out yet. Yeah, okay. So first of all, this is not unheard of. However, second of all, that Caesar clown thing is cool. I didn't even cool. know. Did we know that was a thing? I have no idea. I don't it's even creepy, remember. Though. We might have talked about it, but that well, is cool. These looking. aren't even from C2E2. These are like the shared exclusives. Yeah. Yeah, that's trash. But look at Tony Stark. He already has 100 bucks sitting on him. That's crazy to me. It's not because it's unreleased. And once it's actually released, it's not even Well, no, I'm saying that, that people are valuing him at that. I mean, look, he's right next to like um, an anime Funko Pop. And obviously, anime always does very well. He's only $50 away. That Dragon Ball Z Funko Pop isn't... It's lower. Yeah, but again, keep in mind, these are unreleased. So I understand. The, se yeah, the second right. they're no, released, I, I feel like they're not going to be worth it. Oh, anything. they're going to fall through. Do you remember when um, the year... I think it was 2015 or 2016, they did the uh, Leia and R2 two-pack? Yes, it was the Golden Dark. People were all over that, and they were, like, freaking out. Yeah. And, like, once it was released, it was worth, like, nothing. Nobody cared anymore. No. no. So I feel like, you know... No, no the prices are obviously going to drop. Yeah. I'm just saying it's interesting that they're, like, slapping $100 it on is. that Funko Pop. That's crazy. Because you know they made a ton of them. Yeah. What would be cool is this, this is the start of the lean startup, and they made a very little amount. Can you imagine people going crazy again for stuff like this? Yeah. Like running around chasing them down in the stores and stuff. That would be... That would be amazing. I know that sucks for people, and I know collectors just want to... Okay. Some collectors just want to go to the store and buy what they want, which is why Funko isn't doing so hot. But if Funko released these things on a very limited level like they used to... Remember Target? You'd go there and it would only have like three of each thing? Yes. Like go back to that. Yeah. And then Tony Stark would be sought after. I know. That would be great. That would be amazing. I don't foresee that happening because, what do they say? Funko be Funkoing? No, oh, please. And last but not least, the uh, Ahsoka Tano, her universe exclusive, Diamond <sighs> Collection. It's it's fine. I mean, I'm not a huge Diamond Collection person, but that's, I think it's a cool looking that's the one. Is that the one that she's like taking and it's going to be like exclusive to events that she's going to or whatever? Something like that, yeah. Remember that? Yeah. That, that's... I know, it's silly. It's, it's, it, it's interesting. I mean, it's a draw to get people to come to her, but I 100%. feel like... 100%. I feel like everybody... And then she'll sign her. I don't know. Yeah. It's fun. Whatever. But look, if you're a Soka Tano fan, go get yours. Go meet... Go meet what's her name? Ashley... Eckstein. 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 Go meet her. And then here's all the sales stuff. I want to talk about this. So there is an item right here already sold out. You got this Obi-Wan. He's sold out. These items are still available. That mayor's adorable. Mayor's great. Does he have something special on his heart, or does it just say mayor? Good question, I say. Mayor. Mayor. Yeah. Darn, I, I didn't thought... even know they made that, did you? No, I don't remember seeing that. There's a Sally chocolate. There's a bunch of chocolate. Look, all these chocolate Funko Pops oh did my not God. sell. Yeah. They didn't do well. Look at the Twinkie Jumbo plush. That's amazing. He's Only $7.99 for that? That's insane. That's a 10 inch plush. That's awesome. I don't understand that. I don't either. That's a cool plush. Wow, that's a fantastic price, though. Blue Raspberry Jolly Rancher. Look, it's the Grandma Soda. $12.99. It's not Grandma, it's Nana. Nana. But I I don't know. Look at all the mark. I mean, $7.99, $17.99. I guess he's like, yeah, six inch. Seven nine. Oh my God! There's one of your Sanders favorites. And sisters. Yep. Did you get these? No. With the energy around them or no, magic, I, whatever. I have the original set, and then um, one of our friends gave me the one where they're around the cauldron. Yeah. 
And I that's really cool like one. that one, yeah. But that's the only one. Oh, nope, here, no, no, they got plush and, ones. Oh, that's adorable. $8.99 a piece. I also have the Toonie Terror set. The Toonie Terror set's really great. Yeah, I if love it. If you don't know what Toonie Terrors are, go and check them out. They're by NECA. They're amazing figures. They're so great. Look at all these pins. There's Modoc. Those pins did not do well at all. There's Mo Buttocks. Oh, I like, I like uh, Modoc. I don't have that, I don't think. I like that one now. I thought you did. We had his little mask off. There's Thor and Toga. Vinyl Snoop Dogg in tracksuit. What do you think? I don't care. Why does, why does Barry Allen look like he's in a... He's 80s, in a chair. No, he looks like he's in an 80s metal band. He sort of does, yeah. It's a weird part right? of yeah. That movie did horrible, by the way. It reminds me of ACDC song Thunderstruck, because he's got like lightning all over him. That's playing in the background. God, it's so sad about Blue Beetle. Look at all the Funko Pops and sodas that are still available. They must have made so much. Because you just... I see them all the time. Well, like, always for sale. Okay, for real, though. Did they make so much, or did, like, nobody buy them? Maybe no one bought them. I don't know. I kind of... Look at the ho-ho! I know. No one bought them, but it's only five ninety nine for the ho-ho. My really favorite great. is the um, Hostess Cupcake. That's weird. The Blue Beetle keychain sold out, though. Well, it's three ninety nine, But the Blue Beetle film wasn't bad. That Kara Pax or whatever? That yeah, looks that's the like, villain from Blue Beetle. That looks like he's, like, gearing up to do a big fart. <laughs> hey! What? I told you Heather would have a fart in this video. <gasps> Look at the donut! Donut, ding dong. <laughs> you 2 album cover? Oh, that's stop huge. it. I hate you 2 Me too. Indiana Jones wallet? That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's cute. Indiana Jones, uh, uh, Helena Shaw from the new film. People don't like the new film stuff. They like the old films. A bunch of Witcher stuff. I've heard really good things about that, and There's I've Indy. never seen it. Oh, that Ant-Man moment. I tried watching Witcher. Uh -huh. I, I couldn't keep up. I, I feel like I'm just like an idiot. I That's how I feel smart. about Game of Thrones. Oh. I couldn't, because there's so many people, and yeah. you have to follow it. And I remember getting confused, because don't a brother and sister, like, get down? Oh, yeah. Yeah. A lot of that happens. A lot I of thought so, But then, like, I couldn't keep up, like, who's related and who isn't. I thought that this shirt, <laughs> it says Apex Predator. I thought it said Park Predator, like Jurassic Park Predator. But then I thought Park Predator, like, you know, like a... Uh, like a bad guy. Like a disgusting person. Yeah. <gasps> there was a thing close by where people were caught doing it, like, in the morning, this morning. What? Near a park. Oh, my God. Yeah, they got uh, they got caught for indecent exposure. They caught a hoedown. Th they were doing a lot of hoeing down. Look at that Star Lord plush. I love that. By the way, Guardians of the Galaxy 3, Star Lord did not wear his helmet. Very I, bummed about that. I don't like the look of it. I didn't even know that was Star Lord without seeing the words. Oh, my God. Look at these Overwatch figures. Those are really great. Look how cheap they are. Wow. You can get all three of them. For right around twenty dollars. I mean, obviously with shipping, it'll be more. But damn, that's a really no, good deal. Not if you not if you spend fifty dollars and get your and free, you get, yeah, free, free shipping. Free ship. I like Death Row Records uh, Snoop Dogg mini backpack. Do you want that? That's ridiculous. Look, a bubble tea, Heather. I have one. Nine. I have the Thai one, which is my drink of choice. Wow, they actually have backpacks all in here. Yeah. The, the, that Star Wars backpack isn't bad. For 27 or 20 bucks? It is. I don't like it. Really? Yeah, I, don't I don't think like it's it. bad. That's cool. The Darth Vader glues in the dark. That's really neat. The fancy group. Fancy group with his hat. There's a big, big old hat hair thing. There's some really good stuff here. Yeah, very good. Are you noticing anything sold out? I only noticed like one or maybe two things. There are a couple things. I like that uh, Evil Queen. Which Evil Queen? The three -liter. Oh, yeah. The and then three there's liter. That's Cinderella badass. with the trays. Jeez, $23.99 for that. Down from $40. I mean, three liters? Yeah, three liters. Sharks. I like three liters, though. I like some of them. I really want a robe like Barry Allen has. That's cool. The monkey robe? Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. There's him saving all the babies. Do you remember that scene from the film? I don't even remember watching that. Oh, it was so ridiculous. I loved it, though. It was, like, so, so silly. It was so good, though. Here's another uh, gold figure, uh, Duff McKagan. Cool. Sloth. He's from Guns N' Roses. Give him a break, Heather. Okay. Happy Easter, Doc. That's adorable. These are cool. Oh, my God. 
What super, is that? It's a um, it uh, devil dinosaur from Moon Girl. What is Moon Girl? It was um, it's a cartoon. It's but a there's Marvel a Moon cartoon. Girl there. Yeah, Mo there's Moon Girl. Why is why does Moon Girl look like she belongs in Powerpuff Girls? I don't know. It was the art style, but the Doesn't show. Doesn't she look like power, a Powerpuff Girl sort of villain or something? But I saw the friend. artwork, and the artwork for this show looked really fun. Moon Girl. I it looks it. cool in pop form. All the Dungeons and Dragons pops are here too. That was a great film, and like all the main characters are right there. You can buy the whole entire group, seven ninety nine a piece. I remember watching it. You don't, don't remember know. watching it? Yeah. You don't? No. Moon Girl looks fun. We had movie night. We watched it. How do you not remember? I... <gasps> okay. This right here is the guy that you showed that me got the other mad. day. Yes. We should save that for a video. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, He's this guy, the guy that plays this character on Avatar, let's just say he doesn't like Funko Pops. He made that very clear. Look at the Namor with the whale. The orca. Nine dollars. That's cool. That's a cool, uh, cool uh, piece. I like the salt baker. So uh, we have that. Yeah, I know. That's cool. And we have it the has chase. A chase. Mm -hmm. Pinocchio and Crooked. I really. Cricket. I, I know, said, I said, said it wrong. Crooked. I know, I, it's cricket. He's crooked. I really want to see that movie. I Ooh. feel like I won't like it, but I love Pinocchio. That Kang is badass. Mm -hmm. I like that. I might have to get that. Seven nine nine. There's a bad. Modoc keychain. Yeah, everybody <gasps> wants a keychain. Come on. I love keychains. Look, it's your favorite Bella Porch. Oh my god, no one no one wanted that. And I remember no. people making fun of it when it first came out. Yeah. People were talking about how big of a joke it was. Diecast Thor for thirty seven ninety nine. Uh, that's sad. That Big time. Sad. Yeah. <gasps> Look who it is. Neville! Neville Longbottom. I love Neville. He's got like a little background with him and everything. Jeez, it's all the likely <gasps> things. Dejanay! Who? From the Proud family. Oh, nice. She looks so cute in pop form. But it's all the likely things like Blue Beetle. Then here's all the stuff from Black Panther 2. And Iron Ironheart. Ironheart. She's from Black Panther 2. So a lot of that stuff sat on shelves and did not move. Here's Kamala Khan. Isn't not surprised so to see that one. Sad. It's terrible, yeah. I loved Black Panther. Black Adam. Like big time. A lot of failed like film franchises. That cannot be true. It is. It's it's the penguin and his duck ride. That is one of my favorite things ever. I cannot believe that's still available. That's been out for years. Yeah, I don't know. How like old is this? Twenty twenty two? Is it? Maybe. 2022. Man, I love that. I have it sitting behind me somewhere. Yeah, that is really such good. a cool Funko Pop set. Serpentor is badass too. I cannot believe some of this stuff is here. I love the Captain Hook and he's only $6. Captain Hook. Yeah, that's cool. You know what I would be if I were a captain? I'd be Captain Book. Because I like books. <gasps> Here's your shirt. I love books. Oh my God, that's hilarious. Uh, that's a kid's t-shirt though. Do they, hold on. Can we look at that? Do you want this? Go down. $4.99. You got a large in XL. I could fit in an XL. Do you want one? No. You sure? Look at her weird mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think I think that's a bad choice. Oh, I got a weird mouth. <laughs> that's so funny. Look, it's Peacemaker and his briefs. Remember you made me Indiana what was it? Indiana, Un Undiana Undiana Jones. Jones. Yeah, you made a really cool Indiana Jones. Thanos, those that monster line that nobody wanted, the mech thing. Yeah, that's really uh, ugly. He looks like um like a troll. These dinosaurs are cool. I'm surprised they didn't do well. Casey Jr. Cookies, that didn't oh sell my very God. well. Sixty bucks. A hundred and twenty down to sixty. That's yeah. crazy. Oh my gosh, there's the Mirabelle in the house. Yep. Yeah. And there's uh Bambi on the ice. That's adorable. I'm not a fan of when they make the buildings. The As a bag? Bags, yeah, I don't like that. I thought you have like the Hogwarts castle. I bought you a Hogwarts castle, didn't I? Uh-uh. No? No, I have the one from the New York store with the um, Phoenix. I have one with Deathly Hallows and flowers. Okay. And I have one, you bought me one, it's red. Oh no, it has a castle on the inside of the bag. Yeah. Look, Harry Potter with the letters, twenty two ninety nine. That is so ridiculous. Remember when it was like fifty bucks on Amazon? Yeah, that's like one of the best pops of all time. Agatha, she looks great. Six ninety nine. That's stupid. That's go buy, it. go buy Agatha and go buy Harry Potter with the letters. That is such a good. There is so much detail on that pop. It's ridiculous. So based off of that artwork, are they talking about? 
exclusives to Funko? No, I think what they're saying is exclusives to Fan Rewards members. So I think they're saying, hey, oh, make okay. sure you sign up for Fan Rewards. It, well, it says 70% off exclusives. What do they mean by exclusives? Funko exclusive? Maybe, maybe Funko exclusive. Maybe Funko exclusive. I don't know. Yeah, there's been a, I guess we'll there's find been out. a couple of Funko exclusives I like that I didn't buy. The wording is weird. The wording is weird. I'm interested to see what this new like sale has to offer. Up to 70% off. We could see some t-shirts like you said. I, I wouldn't mind buying some new Funko t-shirts. I love I your t-shirts. I have so you much. You don't want t-shirts. I, I do you know how many Funko and just t-shirts in general that I have? I... Your claws is I, ridiculous. It really I, is. It's a joke. Chris, I filled up a bin of at least 50 t-shirts and I'm still struggling to put clothes in my side of the closet. That's terrible. We have a walk-in closet with like these huge, like hu I'm talking like huge, like wardrobes or whatever, and I can't fit anything. I don't even know like why. <laughs> you, you know you what I know, just said? You don't know how it happens, like a car accident. Yeah, you know what I did the other day? No, no car accidents have, you want to talk about what you did the other day? No, I don't. I tested my new car to see if it would automatically break behind another car. Yeah, he waited till we were this close. I was only going like 30 miles an hour. It was fine. It you was could have tested good. it when I wasn't in the car. <laughs> and then it's just you dealing with your own mistakes. Instead, you had to bring me along for the ride. And I was on the phone and everything. And I didn't even hear what, what the other person on the other line was saying. And then I sounded distracted. <laughs> Because I was distracted because you almost slammed into the person in front of us. What were you saying before you started browbeating me? What did, what did I say? By your closet. Oh, yeah. Oh, I have um, t two new shirts coming this week. Oh, my God, Heather. Okay. All right. Let's end the video. Look, uh, <laughs> the big sales are coming. It's going to be fun for people who love Funko, want to buy a new Funko product, or old Funko product, rather, and get a really good deal. You want to know my favorite thing that I've gotten on sale from Funko is my Funko beanie. Oh, right. I love the Funko beanie. You look great in it, too. Thank you. Yeah. I, know, I don't really wear beanies very often, but as I've gotten older, I like them on me. Yeah, you look good and in a beanie. You know what else I like? I like that my little ears don't get cold. Very I nice. Very cold ears in the winter. That's a plus side. That's the reason to have a beanie, is to warm up them ears. Yep. Yeah. But in every video, we like to shout out to some of our patrons from Patreon. And in this video, we'd like to shout out to R. Perez, Calvin Lee, Derek, Tina Maldonado, Joshua G, Michael Petrino, Joseph Mayfield, Brian, Fanatic Hat, and Greg F. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. We appreciate all of our patrons. You guys are amazing, and we appreciate you and your support so, so much. And remember, before you go, hit the like button, the subscribe button, and the little bell. That way you'll know anytime we go live or post brand new content. You don't want to miss our new content, and we go live every Sunday between 8 and 9 p.m. Eastern. Come and hang out with us. It is a blasty blast. Check out our Patreon at patreon.com slash gasocast if you want to share your support to this channel and to Heather and I. We do a Google Meet call every single month. It's really fun there. We do giveaways, and we also show you upcoming Mischief Toys items. In the most recent call, we showed Mortem, our brand new character, in figure form, and everybody loved him. It was nice to show him off, get some reactions, and also hear some feedback from our patrons. So, check out patreon.com slash gasocast. All right, that's all we've got for this episode. We appreciate you, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. What about money?